Wherever she comes from, she's certainly exquisite. What makes you think she's Turkish? Her, um, hat. Karabu. 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 She appeared from nowhere. Who is it? Oh, that is, uh, a filthy beggar. With nothing but her beauty. She no Greek. She no Turkish. I would know if she was Turkish. And she definitely not Greek. And a remarkable tale. I think that she's saying that her father is a king. She was unable to tell. Gulang? King! Would it be appropriate to kiss her hand? Fancy, Mrs. Waddle. Royalty. These Waddles, they know nothing. They are idiots. But I... Some said she was regal. Para mandalang gilile ikirak ingil idawe. I think she comes from a tribe of woman warriors. She's an imposter. <laughs> Others thought her a rogue. You are a fraud. I know you are a fraud and I have spit in your soup. But from the highly born... My dear, could you imagine the sensation? <laughs> the sensation she would cause. To the highly suspicious... She bites me. She bites me so hard. I know. She won the heart. Quite in charge. Oh, wait. Never in my lifetime has such a flame been lit between you. Have you any idea of the danger you're putting yourself in? Oh, my God. They've sent troops after us. Of all who encountered her, Phoebe Cates, Kevin Klein, Stephen Ray, John Lithgow, and Jim Broadbent in the true story of Princess Caribou. Sometimes the truth can be stranger than fiction.